melting, northwest free state Limpopo, are you guys surviving this heat wave? When can we expect any rain? And it's actually going to be hot on Tuesday. So let's see how hot it's going to get. It's day three of heat wave conditions over northeastern South Africa and also the hottest day for Gauteng on Tuesday with the mercury soaring to 34 in Johannesburg, a sizzling hot 37 in Pretoria and I won't even be surprised if temperatures soar close to 40 degrees over the northern parts of Gauteng. Also upper 30s in northwest and the bushveld and heat wave conditions will continue up until Thursday for most parts of northwest as well as the northern areas of the free state. But when is the rain going to bring relief to this heat. Looking at our rain forecast, only a few isolated thunderstorms are likely to bubble up over the extreme eastern parts on a Tuesday afternoon as well as Wednesday. And only by Friday, we're expecting very isolated thunderstorms to develop over Halteng as well as parts of Mpumalanga that will likely settle the dust but bring no significant rain for the high felt. Our rainfall chart for Tuesday, a region high pushing in some isolated showers for KwaZulu Natal. Due to the heat, isolated thunderstorms likely to develop over the escarpment reaching Mpumalanga and Nampopo. A very slight chance of a few heat induced thunderstorms developing over Halting, but they'll most likely only tease us and bring no rain. Moving to your forecast in the Western Cape, some high level cloud moving overhead with a high of 20 degrees in Cape Town and 23 degrees in Worcester, warming up to 24 in Swellendam as well as Lanesburg and Beaufort West. A warm day for Otwaring with a high of 26 mild along the coast, 21 in Plettenberg Bay and an onshore flow for Nelson Mandela Bay with temperatures in the lower 20s for the coastal areas of the Eastern Cape. A slight chance of a quick morning shower between East London and Port St. John's, otherwise partly cloudy to mostly cloudy over the eastern areas. And then an onshore flow will push in a cloud and cool conditions for KwaZulu Natal, much cooler compared to a hot and humid Monday with isolated showers likely and thunderstorms expected over the escarpment as well as a few heat induced thunderstorms likely over Ermelo, Emakazeni and the high felt of Mpumalanga. And hot day for Limpopo heat wave conditions will continue to sizzle the bush felt with temperatures in the upper 30s. It's another scorcher for northwest also becoming windy there for the South African weather service is warning against runaway fires on Tuesday. In the northern Cape a cool onshore southerly wind blowing along the coast, cooling down Alexander Bay, but it's sunny and hot over the northern and central parts, temperatures above 30 degrees. Heatwave conditions for the northern parts of the free states where runaway fires are at risk and temperatures soaring above 30 degrees. It's the final and hottest day of heatwave conditions in Halting, the mercury soaring to 37 degrees in Pretoria. And then into Wednesday, only a few degrees lower in Halting, still hot the afternoon at 33 degrees in Victoria and then into Thursday becoming yet again extremely hot the afternoon soaring to 33 in Johannesburg and we've got a cold front reaching the Western Cape bringing light rain for the southwestern areas and later along the southern coastline. Well that's all from me and no matter the weather we're in this together. <laughs>